It's time to reveal my design for 10-year-old Heath's bedroom. I'm taking a rather unorthodox approach with positioning the bed. Now, what's going to happen is the bed is going in a slightly strange place, which is diagonally across the room. Come on. And, uh, <laughs> we've, we've forced him into it. Go on, you have to lie with him. There we go. See? Lying yeah. like this. Now, this isn't just me being weird. We're going to be left with this incredibly cosy little study nook, because then the gaming section is going to be at the end of the bed there. Right. If it was anyone else, who just put the bed up against the wall. I know. Yeah. I think this is going to start a big thing in this country. I like it. It's good. You've done all right. <laughs> Can I have that on a T-shirt? The key here is zoning 10-year-old Heath's room into work and play areas. And for that, I need master craftsman Tibby to help me fit his pre-cut Japanese-inspired room dividers into the space. It's typical, they get the light one, two of them, leaving me with the difficult one. So these two will connect at about across this there. point across right. there. Yeah, okay. And then we've got the one going on the other side. You know where all the zones are, you know we've got gaming, sleeping, sitting, and where Tibby is, we've got the workstation. Okay. Everyone happy? happy yeah. Let's just build it then, come on. <laughs>48 hours ago, this room was more like a grey cell than a young boy's bedroom. It was dark, bland, and devoid of identity. Now it's a funky, zoned, and feature-packed homage to Japan with warm colours and stimulating design. Entering this room is to enter an immersive, multi-dimensional gamescape layered with texture, restful colours and meaningful objects. Key to my design is the bold positioning of the bed placed diagonally across the room. Arching above it are the intricate room dividers with their echoes of both Japanese craftsmanship and modular living. And neatly tucked away behind the bed is a homework zone for quiet study, while a fun area for Heath to relax and play his games lies at the foot of the bed. Let's hope Lois and Nick are ready to embrace my Japanese-inspired maximalism. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm absolutely speechless. <laughs> oh, wow. This is insane. Unbelievable. He's going to absolutely love it. I think the thing that's missing is a heat. He's going to lose his mind. Yeah. I've lost mine, so... Now the reaction I really care about. With older brother Nolan, the man of the moment. Come on in. <laughs> oh, my <Whoa>. God. <laughs> I did not expect that. <laughs> what do you think of your bed? <laughs> it's cool, hey? So, do I pass? Yes, definitely. Do I? Oh, wow. Take a, give me a mark. I'm Thank you very much indeed. <laughs> that, that'll do. I was a bit overwhelmed because I just thought, God, he's going to love this so yeah, much. Definitely. It's absolutely everything that he's yeah. interested in. Yeah. So it's like being inside yeah. his mind. I thought it was a dream at first, but I didn't pinch my arm because I didn't want to wake up from it. 